Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Irvin, with another light novel chapter review. It's been a while since I've done a light novel chapter review, but I'm finally back doing light novels. Uh, I am continuing doing Reborn as a Vending Machine and I Don't Wonder the Dungeon. I have other light novels that I have bought in that I want to review as well. So uh, just make sure you guys keep up with me and I will let you guys know, uh, or you guys will see them being released here. Uh, chapter by chapter. So today we have chapter three of this uh, great uh, weird premises type of light novel. And before I start, I want to say a few things. One, if you have not done, if you haven't done so, check out the first and second chapter reviews in my channel. Secondly, guys, if you also haven't done so, subscribe to my channel, and uh, you guys will be able to see some otaku related uh, and weave related uh, content here. And then lastly, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching the video, but if you don't want the chapter to be ruined, then uh, I'm warning you, there is some spoilers coming up. Okay, so the name of this chapter is uh, A Buyer Arrives, I believe, or, or just A Buyer, and uh, the vending machine has... Uh, it, it was, I, I guess, at, uh, at the beginning or at the end of the last chapter, he was still fighting against the frog-looking creatures, and uh, at the beginning of this chapter, they basically give up and leave, and he spent a lot, a lot of points to recover. Uh, again, his points are used to recover, and he doesn't know what happens when he has no points, uh, but he needs to have points to, you know, he thinks he needs points to be alive. Now, I don't know if that's true. It could be. Uh, also... He can only earn points by someone buying stuff out of his vending machine or out of his body because he's now a vending machine. So uh, he finally hears a voice, and it's a girl, and she is looking for uh, for food. She she's kind of talked to herself, saying that she's a she she has this power, but even though it's good, if she can't use it, it doesn't matter. Uh, she's talking about how she's hungry, how she disappointed her mom and dad, blah, 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 blah. She, anyways, ends up, uh, reaching the vending machine and realizes that she needs to use money to get food out of this machine. Uh, she doesn't want to hurt it, so the machine's happy. And, uh, we also learn that they use the bronze, uh, or the copper, bronze, silver, gold type of coin system in their world so to buy something out of him essentially uh she needed to use i think uh a few copper coins or a silver coin so she used enough money where he raised i believe a hundred 160 points i oh, know he only raised uh 63 points that's nothing but she spent 6300 yen because she ended up liking the food so she ended up keep buying and buying so uh, at the end of the chapter, she just ends up sitting next to him and falling asleep. He obviously has that protection shield or, or, or field that if someone tries to attack her, he can protect her. So he says, you know, she's been a great person to me. I'm just going to protect her if someone comes to attack her. So uh, by, by his description, I'm going to guess it was her. He did describe the whole having uh, a leather shield and uh, her having shorts, her having uh you know, kind of gloves. So I'm 100% sure it's her. Now, in the front cover, she doesn't have ears. In the back cover, she does. So I don't know. He didn't even mention her having ears. So I have no idea. Uh, I'm going to guess the next chapter, she's going to want to take him with him. I'm not really sure. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, again, this is a series that is a different premises. Uh, he was reincarnated as a vending machine. So a lot of people dog on it because it sounds kind of stupid and and to be honest up to now there hasn't been anything special other than the very detail on how the point system works on how uh the the power system works i i enjoy that of isekai um light novels if they actually give you all those details uh because sometimes you, you have Izakai that are more focused on appearances, they're more focused on the etchiness of them, that you basically just have a harem in a different world. And that's not really what you want. You want details. You want details of what the world is about, what this, this kind of society building. Um, one that I trash talked at the beginning and now have gone back on my word is that time I was reincarnated as a slime uh, because... The premises of it sound like, well, it's going to be an etchy one. It's just going to be one of those uh, um, 
mangas and animes. Well, it, it wasn't. It actually ended up being good, and the anime ended up being great. Uh, so, you know, so, so much people are talking about it uh, right now. So, anyways, uh, guys, if you have not done so, check out the first and second chapter to learn more about this one. I will release the fourth one, hopefully, sooner than later. Uh, and uh, with nothing else to say, guys, uh, make sure you subscribe, and like always, don't be strangers.